work on getting. I'm gonna play with the trains. I was having fun. It's a train. It's a train day. Day to play with trains. Why do I have some iron ingots on me, or copper ingots on me? Do I have any? I don't have any. I was gonna say if I have any of the uh, aluminum ingots on, maybe I would turn them into something. A steel ingot and a limestone still sitting on the ground there. Hmm. Thought, I thought stuff I threw on the ground might disappear over time, but apparently not. So. What all do I need? If I want to play with the trains. I need... Need more uh, uh, pipes, and steel pipes, and steel. Let's see, we'll find them. Steel pipes and steel. There they are. Okay, I think I need some motors as well. Okay, so. Let's go down to vehicles. Okay, I won't need the... I'm not making any more trains. However, to make the train station I do need... and platforms, I do need computers. Oh, uh, and... a lot of cable. And a lot of cement. And a couple motors. Okay, so... Here's my motors. Wow, well, apparently I had two storages. Um, need to reinforce uh, frames. I need more of them. There they are. Heavy modular frames. Uh, what else did I say I needed? Ah, computers. I think this is computers? No? This one? Yes. Why is that storage all messed up? I don't know. Oh, that's one of the ones I yanked out and put back in. That's why. Okay. So. Also, let's see what else here we might need. Uh, we are going out, so we will need the gun ammo. May need some noblest, so we'll take that. Pass on anything else. And we're going to need a little bit more fuel, just in case. Fuel. Fuel, fuel, fuel. Is it? Fuel's already... There it is. Oh! That's not good. I didn't realize I was getting that low on fuel. Okay, I got a full inventory, but it should be fine. Okay, now. I really should mark the, uh, put a beacon on the train stop. Got a decent amount of roses? Yeah, I got a lot of them. Thought so, because I had to use them to make things. Okay.
There we go. There we go. Now we got train station main hub right there. I wonder if the train's coming back around any soon. No, it hasn't even reached the other station yet. Oh yeah, it has. Should be in the other station any minute now. Yeah, it could be in the other station actually. The Caterium node is not... I gotta pick up that uh, beacon. I don't need it anymore. And put it one on the train station. Why is the train not moving yet? Oh, there it goes. That's its roll backwards before it takes off, so it's moving again. Oh, well, wouldn't it be awesome if the uh, if the map uh, actually like was modular, like updated, so you could see stuff that you put down and stuff? <laughs> that would be cool. Okay. Oops, I hate doing that because it uses up a whole... Oh, no, it didn't. I thought it was going to use up more than it did. to the other station to put down some beacons. Put a beacon down at the other station next. You gonna unload or is it full? It can't be full, it's unloading, it's moving. Once I start using, once I get my quick wire production and all those going, it'll start using up the material and it'll start dropping it off again. That looks weird right there, that connection. It's light shadows on it. over there. I could probably get a train over to those. Start bringing the ports in. Ah, bauxite's more important. I really need to get some bauxite in here. I mean, I do have um, conveyors, but...
I forgot to pick up the Caterium or Beacon. Where is it? It's over here somewhere. And why are these rocks back? What the hell? That is odd, and I just missed my ride. Or not. I'd be fine if I'd stopped bumping into the thing and losing all my forward momentum. Okay, so... Once I can make multiple trains, I'll have like an I am Caterium runner, and, I, and the train will just have two, the four cars, and so so it'll just be picking up two uh, Caterium and uh, an iron, and just running to all the Caterium, and then I'll have different cars like that, so they have shorter routes, and that can get the stuff in here faster. But that's once they fix the bugs with trains, and you can actually have multiple trains on one track. How's this doing anyway? Is it filling up? Oh, you can't look at it while it's in the process, I forgot. Bye-bye train. Yeah, it's getting there. If it wasn't pulling two impure nodes worth out of it, it, it would probably feel faster, but... It's two impure nodes. Okay, so... With that in mind... We want... We want the bauxite, but we can't really get to the box. Let me. It helps if I hit the right buttons. Map. See the bauxite's up here. Oh, I needed to take some supercomputers to that pod. There's some quartz node, and it's black area because uh, I, that's that's the top, and the quartz node is actually in a cliff, in underneath the cliffs. It's actually on this level here. If you walk right in here, you'll get to the quartz nodes. That one just needs some power. Huh, wonder if I have any power lines near there. That one right there just needs turbo motors. Okay, yeah, that one was that was one of those nodes put in before we had uh, one of those uh, beacons I put in before we had uh, uh, Nebulus. Nebulus. And believe it or not, I actually explored a lot of this map. I mean, I have, st I actually have geyser uh, power, and geyser power is all like way up here. Is where you can find, is where you can find geyser power, and find geysers. But that was all before the map existed. Okay, so Do I have a turbo motor? I don't think I do. So the question is, what does it take to make one? Nothing I have on me. Okay, good to know. Okay, it takes a heat... a heat sink. Four of them. 
as well as four radio or two radio control units and lots of rubber. Huh. And radio control units take heat sinks too. Wow. Yeah, I'm nowhere near making a turbo motor right now. I do not have the required uh, equipment. And I can't hit the right button. That pod's unknown. So we have two train stations. We Maybe we'll go up here and see about setting up another train station for the, for the other Caterium. The other Caterium spot. I thought I did. Huh. Yeah, well. It'll be nice once you can actually ter have multiple trains on. to my Caterium, I just gotta follow that bell. See where it goes. Now I think it has a, my train tracks already have a branch point heading that way. I think, I think, I think, and yes, there's a split right here, designed, set up to follow head towards the Caterium. And yes, I was, I've tried to make sure my tracks aren't, tr or aren't clipping too much, but I was actually kind of Okay, I was about to say, dude, dude, turn! Well, I actually like the, like the tracks on the ground going through. Even though you can't. Oh, that one's going to be clipping. Well, that power line doesn't matter. I can, I'm going to remove that power line eventually anyway. Because I won't need it. Because this, the trains will do. Oh. Huh. I don't even know if I can take a train up that. Wow. Uh. Huh. Criterium. Yeah, that's pretty steep. I don't. I'm pretty sure a train cannot come up that. Don't remember what. I, oh, this was where. Yeah, uh, I thought so. This is where there used to be a a, a pod. I wonder if one of the updates came since they stole one of my. Yeah, it's that's already open. One of my one of my uh, alternate schematics disappeared, so I'm a little pissed about that. Stitched uh, plating or stitched reinforced plating or something like that is basically an alternate for uh, iron reinforced platings. Okay, so this is where the Caterium is. This was the first Caterium node I uh, I tapped because the other one over there. Uh, had the boulders on it, and back when I first tapped Caterium, you couldn't uh, remove boulders. So, yeah. And this is a pier node anyway. Okay, so... Well...
Conveying it a little distance to a train is fine. Maybe I should build a station out here somewhere. For it. Wait, how's, how flat is it up here? Flat enough for a station? If I started building the station at this end and went out that way, I can probably make a 10 car station. I wonder if there's any other nodes around here, though. Oh, the only other nodes around here, we got two iron. That is literally it. Two iron nodes. Well, that is disappointing, ain't it? Actually, I think that... Oh. That disappeared too fast. Because... I know there's Caterium right there and it didn't ping. Or I didn't see the ping, which means it had already vanished. Okay. We've got that one there. Come on, you've got to ping that one there and those, that's it. Okay. Oh, there's another Caterium over there, huh? The only Sulfur is the one over here that we already got? Yeah, that's the one we're already hitting, okay. Okay, Quartz. I think the only Quartz one is the one over here that we already marked. Wow, there's Sulfur over there too. Yeah. Oh, there's another quartz one over there. Wait, that's the quartz one we're already mining. That's the one we're currently hitting. Okay. Bauxite. Got that one, that one, and that one, I believe. Yeah. There's one more over here. I guess it's too far away to ping. Cause I'm, I'm hitting, I'm pulling three out of there. Hopefully there's none of that around here. Wow, oh, there's uranium in there. Hmm. Okay, the iron ore, we know there's a couple of them around here. Yeah, those... Any copper around? Oh, there's a copper right next to that iron. Whoa, there's a copper by the... Oh man, I probably need to put cart that in there too then. Oof! Did not realize there was a copper there. Okay, but we do have a copper here too, so looks like we can hit iron and copper and caterium in this train too. Not that we really need limestone, but let's see if it's... Oh, there's limestone right here too. Damn, this is area is good for... Uh, yeah, this is a good for spot for a train depot. Of course, getting the train back down from here might be fun. 
Okay, um, coal. I'm going to assume there's no coal nearby. I think the only coal was over here somewhere. I'm already... Huh. That's not as far away as I thought it was going to be either. Oh, we should probably bring the coal in uh, eventually too. And there sh shouldn't be any crude oil. Yeah. There's no crude oil near us. Okay. Wow, I was going to wait for it. Holy, wow. Three of them are way over there, though. Okay, so I like the idea of a train here. The only problem is finding a way back down once we get it up here. Which should be over here just fine, actually. We should be able to get back down over here, right? Wow. There's one hilly bit of terrain. Yes! Uh, it looks like there's already a... Uh, I thought I saw a split, maybe not. Yes, I'm already splitting it up here. It's right there. Uh... Oh. Maybe... I should do it the other way then. Because... Oh, look at that. <laughs> Yeah. I should start on this side. And go that way. This is going to be funny right in the middle of the jungle, but that's exactly what I'm going to do. Okay, first off... It's right over there, going that way. Now... Oh, the rocks, though. Gotta be careful of the rocks. We're gonna try. So this is going to be... My jungle. Ooh, I don't think I got it high enough. Oh. <sighs> yep, we're looking at trains going in. Not acceptable. And yes, I could build it on on a platform, but... I like the... the whole...
Okay, so and I should have poles holding it up. Yes, it does. Perfect. So it doesn't look so stupid. Okay, that's gonna go that way. Yes. <laughs> Uh, where did that- oh, that built on the wrong side. I was like, where the hell did that build? Okay, two empty platforms. Okay, hmm. Now this one's going to, this one's iron. Where was the iron? Hold up. Okay, what the hell? Okay, so two of them are on my right, one's on the left. So we will make the iron entrance, iron freight platform connect with its depots on the right. The platform for the Caterium, though, is going to come from that side, and we are out of cable. Lovely. We did not, we knew we needed a lot of cable, we did not bring enough with us. And of course, I will blow up the trees and stuff that are in the platform after I finish building the platform. How's the iron? How's the iron doing? Should be getting pretty full, I think. Oh, there's a wire running around it. Oh, that's one of the wires that I will be removing eventually. Okay. Oh yeah, the iron's getting pretty full. Cool. Now we just need to get some cables. Once I get that caterium running out of there, I can get rid of this line here. Line looking nicer. I mean, I got my iron line looking nice. Okay. Cables are in, in the seas, which are on this. I'm pretty sure it's this one. It is. Was that a flash? Okay, I don't know. Hope the train don't hit me. Probably will. I hear it stopping at the station. It won't be there long. Okay. So where did I branch it? Oh, there it is. This is where... no? What the... Oh, it branches over there. Oh, I probably should have branched it here too. Eh. It's okay. One branch should be enough. 
to figure it out. Can always add another branch later. Okay, so for good measure, just while we're working, we're gonna go ahead and pull one of these down. Make it bright red. That way I know what it is. Okay, so that's the branch I'm track branch I'm going towards. With my current with the train station I'm building up here. I just gotta find my train station. There it is. Oh, what? Um, I think it's going to avoid that, which, oh, well, I guess we'll have, uh, yeah. Now, I do like the fact that, oh, wait, that one doesn't have, why doesn't that have, whatever. Okay, so this is the iron one. The Caterium one comes in from the other side. Okay, and now I don't have enough concrete. Ay 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 ay. Okay, we are at tr we are at car four. Yeah, this is car four. Yeah, it looks like we'll be okay, and we'll actually be able to pull some limestone straight in. Oh, it's a pure node too. That's a lot of limestone to pull in. And it is going pretty much towards my cutoff, so that's great. I'm just not bringing all the materials I need with me, apparently. And I'm bringing materials I don't need. Why am I carrying around copper ingots? I'm getting rid of those copper ingots. There, no more copper ingots. Oh, I think that flash is coming off the... yeah, okay. It's just a weird flash off the iron node. I should probably do something with those nodes. I got three of them. I mean, I realize they're impures, but they're... I mean... Free ore that's already there, why not, right? I think, yeah, I think I have plenty of concrete already in here. In case anyone's curious about my bus system, I actually have a main bus, runs down, and everything comes across the main bus. After, at the end of a production line, like this, oh, looks like my iron line, my iron ingot line backed up, there's a, uh, drop that takes it down to my main storage area, and the main storage area feeds the main bus. So it's a... Uh, everything goes that way. But anyway, I'm going... I'm here for some concrete. And it takes a lot of concrete. I think it's like 25 of a uh, station. Should have planned that out by bringing enough with me. jungle's called. I, I wish the map had the names of the places on it.
because the track's right around here. I'd probably call it jungle. Because this, I call this one Caterium Cliffs. Which is funny because this Caterium node is the one that th this train's going to load. Okay, it's going to be a 10 car station. Pretty sure most of the cars are not going to be used, but we're going to, just because we can't use little stations, because uh, you can't split and have different trains, we're going to go ahead and... Okay, yeah, that's bugging me. That should probably really have a split right here. Although I guess I can come up there, it goes around, it makes sense actually. I'm just gonna leave it. I'm gonna quit, quit complaining about it eventually, honest. Honest, I will. Okay, so. This is the iron car, this is the Caterium car. What else was up here? We have, oh, we have a... Should we make the third, the fourth car, uh... Hmm. How f On that question, how far away is my sulfur? No, a sulfur's way over here. That's not being, being brought to this station. I need another station over there. But while we're at it, we're going to go ahead and put a beacon down on this station so we can find it easier. Okay, now back to what we were doing. Okay, so this one is train, is car five. One, two, three, four, five. Hmm. Okay, so that's the 10 train cars, and that is pretty steep. Let's see where that goes if I, I... Yeah, I realize too long. I'm not trying to put it down. I'm trying to make sure you're not going to clip if I go there. You are partially clipping, I think. So we're going to go like... I think we're going to go like that. Okay, now we got that done. And we got the cars come up here. Ten cars long. I like the way this looks actually. Gotta get some out of the middle though. That was not a 
Not where I was aiming at. Okay. Okay. Kind of. Kind of like. It. Ah, I gotta get rid of those ones though. Yeah, I think I gotta get rid of you too. Wish I had. I wish the chainsaw would run on uh, bio. I mean, on actual fuel instead of just biofuel. Eh. That's good. And... Hey, yeah. Okay. Okay, so that's connected, so I can pick up that other beacon now. What annoys me is pick up picked up beacons don't restack with me. Okay. Now where does this power line just go to? Just across? Yes. So oh ouch. So we can actually literally get rid of this power line. This power pole right here. And then reconnect everything. Like that. Wonder what that power line ran to though. Squirrel running and running to see where a line ran. I don't remember what I ran this line to. Oh, I think there was a pod over here that required power. And I don't think I took the line back up afterwards. Which could be useful. I think there was uh, something else over here too. Yeah, this is the line that ran to the pod that required power. Which I may not have disconnected after running power to it? Huh. Oh yeah, I did disconnect it. I uh, just left the power, some of the power lines. Okay. Figured it out. Which means these power lines are not needed. And so we'll take them down just so I don't get confused thinking there's something I need to keep up. They are not cooked up to anything. Which, of course, well, let's take them all down. Up. Up while I'm at it. Uh, where'd the next one go? It was over here somewhere, right? I thought it was. Wasn't it? Oh, there it is. Okay, now you are connected to something, so we'll stop there.
Okay. I'm thinking copper should be the fifth car. And this used to cause... This is one of the bugs that's supposed to be fixed. Hey look, it didn't crash everything. Must be fixed. Okay. Now, we need to take the forest freight stop. Take the forest freight stop and head it to head down. Head down that ramp there to meet up. Make sure that's not clipping too much. Little bit of clip is acceptable. Too much of clip would bug the crap out of me. Okay, yeah, that's a little bit's fine. There we go. Now, instead of running down through this canyon here, and that way, this line should run that way and meet up with it to go to the train station. Right? Can it? Uh, let's see here. Goes this way. Maybe it can run over that. And there, it's gotta go that way. Okay, it looks like that that would take a long way to go around. So maybe I do have to take it the way I originally was going. Wow. I could use uh, lifts and take it over. I mean, it's still got to go in. Oh, never mind. I can't take it around because the car, it's its going into this one here. Because that's car one, car two. This is where it's going in. And if I run this way, straight out from where it's going in, I go around those cliffs. Okay, so yeah, I gotta bring it up that way. Hmm. That's interesting. I wonder if there's any enemies around. It's a spot I'm a barrel nut I missed, so there could be enemies around. Seriously, I could just take it over here, though. Oh, actually, that's... Yeah, that's where I need to take it. Okay, so I need to bring it up this. Which is not a big deal.
That's where I'm probably taking it up. Okay. So, where is it? It's over there. So, bring it from here, up to here, and then there. There, perfect. <laughs> My inventory is going to get full. Let's go put the Caterium in the train. Uh, car... Car 4 is Caterium. I just gotta remember, Car 4. Caterium is Car 4. Iron is Car th uh, 3. I like the fact that it puts the beams down for you, so it doesn't look completely stupid and floaty because it has beams. Nice. Okay, so this is car 3. So this is car 4. Right? 1, 2, 3, 4. Yes. Free up a little bit of inventory space. Dismantle, there it is. That. What? Huh. I'm guessing I was planning on trying to go up that ramp to change my mind. And then missed a piece while I was dismantling it. I'm getting a lot of encased industrial- I'm gonna need them. I can't worry about don't getting rid of them. I, I'm gonna need them. Quite that many. I gotta put some of these away. I got way too much stuff. I mean, my inventory's getting full. What I need to do is actually.
take a five minute break, stretch my legs. Been sitting in this chair for almost two hours now. So, as soon as I clear out my inventory here, I'm gonna go ahead and take like a five minute break. Let's see here. Don't need quite as many because we're not stretching across the map now. And that's a problem. I don't think there's a storage for those. Did, I, did they already go through? Uh, maybe they did? Or maybe I already mo removed that splitter too and they're, already, and they're in here? Okay, where did those sheets go? Because they started moving already. I didn't think I had iron sheets out here anywhere. Oh, apparently I did leave an iron sheet storage out here. I only left I only left one instead of the normal three and four like the others have, but I did have one out here. Good. Um, guess I won't have to worry about putting too much out here. We're gonna drop some more in there then. Now yeah, this splitter used to be solid splitter, alphabetically splitting anything and everything I drop, but... Over time, I was, as I was removing things... They were put inside. I think that's enough inventory cleanup for now. Okay, we're going to take us like a five minute break and we'll be back shortly.